means. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome aboard the inaugural flight of Pippi Air. I will be your pilot today. Uh, Pippi, <laughs> fittingly. Yes, I named the airline after myself. Um, <laughs> that, that's how it works, right? Like, United Airlines was started by someone named United, and Delta Airlines was started by a dude named Delta, right? That, that's how it works, right? Right? Alaska Air was started by someone named Alaska. Was I misinformed on this? Anyway, uh, it doesn't matter. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I am super duper thrilled to be attempting my first attempt <laughs> to be a pilot. That's exactly how it works. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, so I wasn't misinformed. I wasn't too terribly confused. Good to know. Good to know. Uh, let's see here. Now, uh, I am legally required... Where's the paper? Um, legally required to inform you that, uh, despite being a pilot here, I do not actually have a totally legal pilot's license, uh, but it doesn't really matter because I have special clearance from the FAA. Uh, because my initial attempt to fly a plane was greatly delayed by their computer outage. So, to make it up to me, they decided, hey, you know what, we'll just give you full clearance on everything. Uh, yeah, it's true, you can ask the president of the FAA himself, he said it to me personally, in real life, in front of my face. <laughs> now then, uh... Let's see here. Without further ado, uh, we need to go ahead and... Oh, I just realized that I put chat over the top of the funny gif. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, I can't move it. I can't move chat! Chat is trapped there! Okay, I'm moving the airplane over here then to fly over the tip of uh, Mew's tail instead. There we go. Uh, <laughs> so... Yes, I may not have any actual pilot qualifications, but I can still be a pilot, right? Right? 
I'm gonna say yes. Uh, now, disclaimer, I have not tried streaming this game before. Microsoft Flight Simulator, that is. Uh, and it is notoriously a very graphic, intensive game. Um, so if it cannot be streamed, I will make some attempts to uh, alter the graphic settings to see if it can be streamed effectively. Uh, if I can't figure it out, then we'll play something else. But as far as I know, I think I've got the settings uh, in a state where I can actually play it while on stream. We'll see. We'll see. But there's no promise that the game is going to work. There's a reason this stream is called Which Will Crash First, The Plane or My Computer. <laughs> you adore the customizations I've done for this. Thank you. I figured I would go all out because <laughs> I'd been anticipating doing this for literally a week because this game had a five hour update download that it had to do right as I was going to start streaming it last week. So I figured I may as well go all out. And I had fun looking up like airplane gifts and, and stuff. <laughs> all right. Let's see. I'm gonna real quick. Put a uh, stop on this background noise and shift right into video game mode. Welcome to Microsoft Flight Simulator. Um, this is a game where you can simulate flying in an airplane. Um, fun fact, last week when I was trying desperately to get the five hour download to go through, uh, my dear friend Saw, who just subbed earlier, thank you for that Saw, uh, saw the Steam notification popping up saying that I was playing this, and um, <laughs> she thought that it read Minecraft Fight Simulator. <laughs> so apparently all day she thought I was playing something called Minecraft Fight Simulator, <laughs> which honestly I would love to play, but you made something in Artiste Moments. Hold the phone, let me take a look. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, I love that. Hold on, I got, I got, I got, I, I, I got, I got to put this on screen real quick. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. See, is this on the? Yes. Oh, I love that. It's got, it's got the Clementine, the cat, and the, and the cat. And the, oh, I love that. And the cheese that's in the back. That's perfect. I got, I got to make this one like my, um, my new, my new profile pic. I love that. As always, heavy, heavy again, a heavy again with the thingies. <laughs> that is awesome. I love that. Thank you. Thank you. I preach. I preach. <laughs> Beautiful stuff. And I think I got, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm definitely, let me actually, actually, before I forget, let me, let me download that so that I can have that available. There we go. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You've improved drastically at Gmod recently and you're having a ton of fun. There is definitely an art to Gmod stuff. Um, I... <laughs> the way to make stuff in Gmod escapes me personally, but that makes it all the more impressive for me when people can make anything in it, especially something that pretty and detailed. I love that. Uh, what do I... Whoa! I have only one hour of flying. The only thing I have done on this game thus far uh, is try to test it just a little bit to configure the controls for my controller, because playing this game on keyboard is reportedly a bit of a nightmare. Um, oh, ooh, ooh, is that my plane? Is that my plane? That's my plane! That's my god dang plane! Uh, one of my planes anyways. I have more planes than this. Can I? Ooh, whoa, who are you people? Who is, who is that? How do, uh, how do I turn on the engine and run them down? How do I do that? I don't think I'm allowed to do that, actually. Darn! Oh, well, okay. So I've barely done any actual flying in this. Just barely enough to ensure that the controls are configured 
decently enough to make it work. Uh, so, let's think about this. How do we want our inaugural flight to go? This game is incredibly customizable, by the way. I'm deeply impressed by it. Uh, they've got all these different airports. Can Is there an airport in Antarctica? I know there's a way to land in Antarctica in real life, but I legitimately don't know if they actually have that available in this game. Um, which would be understandable. Uh, let's see. What kinds of U.S. airports have we got? Because these are the ones that I know the best. Uh, do they have... Surely they have... They do have the Atlanta airport. They do! Ah! Now, in real life, this is the airport that I am the most familiar with. I've probably flown out of the Atlanta airport more times than any other airport in my life, and I've done a decent bit of flying, so, uh, that says quite a bit. Um, if you live in kind of the south, Atlanta is just where you go to get anywhere else, basically. So, we could start here, set as departure, um... How? Whoa! Oh my god! Okay, there's a lot to choose from. Um, I feel like I need to go for the longest runway <laughs> to give me the best shot of surviving. Uh, I mean, um, of absolutely 100% taking off. Um, there's zero risk involved. <laughs> oh, you're so right! They should make a Microsoft Submarine Simulator. I would be all over that. I would be all over that. As long as it included creatures that you could find as well. Oh boy, I have a lot of planes. Uh, They've got, like, helicopters and, good lord, like, military planes. They've got gliders, uh... Oh, 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 the big boy! Oh, the big boy! Uh, I'm gonna wait on that one. This is... Where's the, the one that it put me in? Supposedly, this is the easiest pl starter plane to fly, so I'm just gonna stick with that for now. Um, do we want to go anywhere in particular? Honestly, I feel like we should just kind of try flying for now. Uh, flight conditions. Um, we can do live weather. Uh, what is the live weather like here right now? Uh, partly cloudy. I mean, honestly, I mean, this is in Atlanta, not where I am, but that looks fine. Let's, let's, let's do that. Let's do, let's do the live stuff. Yeah. Okay. And then I guess let's fly. <laughs> Oh, Lord of Mercy. Let me see if I can actually remember uh, how to use the controller for this, because I configured some of the buttons, but I've actually kind of forgotten what some of them are supposed to do. <laughs> see, the closest thing I can think of to a submarine simulator game right now is that one game, Iron Lung. Is that what it's called? But that one's a horror game, and is also absolutely beyond terrifying. <laughs> so, well, I say that, but the less horror version of being in a submarine in a video game would probably be Subnautica, and I love Subnautica so much. <laughs> I need to finish Subnautica on stream one of these days. Whoa. Oh, wait, are we already flying? What? Why are we in the air? Oh. Okay, cool. What? I'm moving! Is that me? Oh, I forgot I... <laughs> I forgot I said the... <laughs> the plane number to... <laughs> I forgot. I forgot. Um, uh-oh, hold on. I need to... plug my controller back in here to make sure that it is working. <laughs> nice. Uh... Hey, controller? New device detected. Uh, customized with what all I had. Please tell me it kept all of my controls. Yes, thank god, okay. <laughs> I am currently using- I don't have an actual, like, flight joystick 
for plane games. Um, I'm flying this plane on a Nintendo Switch Pro controller <laughs> because here at uh, at Pippi Air, we only use the finest and most sophisticated pieces of technology to get you to your destination safely. Uh, let's see. Except it's not working! No! <laughs> Don't do this. And then it disappeared! What? No! Don't do this now! We're closer to taking off now than we've ever been! No! I <laughs> hold every single thing. Oh my god. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, technical difficulties on the flight deck, everyone. Uh... Oh my god. You can't be serious. I got all of this set up. All of it set up. And now it won't... You're actually... You have to be... You have to be joshing me, computer. You have to be. I can still do the mouse controls, but the mouse and keyboard controls actually suck. <laughs> Why? Okay, hold on. Technical difficulties on the, uh... The flight deck. Give me just one moment here. Um, I'm going to... See if I can figure out what the frick frack patty whack is going on and why this will not connect. Uh, now it's not even recognizing that it's plugged in. Are you actually serious? Device manager, take me to device manager. Nope, it's not showing up there. If the- I'm actually gonna scream if this doesn't work! <laughs> I've been working on this for a week! Why now? Okay, yeah, it's not- it's not recognizing that it's plugged in. I'm not sure why it's not recognizing that it's not plugged in. Hey, video game. Why? <laughs> Hold on, on-screen trouble- or on-stream troubleshooting. Okay, how to get computer- no, Hold on, I'm gonna put, like, computer- Computer won't recognize. Switch Pro Controller. It's never done this before. I used this controller the whole time I played Octodad. Uh. Okay. Settings is basically means the controller would only work when plugged up instead of wirelessly. I don't care about it being wireless. I know it has to be plugged in. Pro controller doesn't attempt to connect your switch wirelessly. Turn on. I've never con I've never connected it to the switch actually. Well, it's not a problem with the switch. Oh lord! Oh, hold up. Let me take a sip. I did pack some strawberry lemonade body armor for the flight. Restart the PC! Restart the PC?! You're joking. Is that really the solution? One stream without technical difficulties. That's all I'm asking. 
This thing was working perfectly the other day when I put all the controls in place. It... Hold on. Switch Pro Controller. Oh, I, I almost forgot. Um, legally, I'm obligated to put this music on. Oh, legally, I'm obligated to play this whenever there's technical difficulties in the background. Um, <laughs> yep, this is how it goes. <laughs> Disable the controller. That is an A plus mode. <laughs> Better. What? There's a program I have to download to make it work? I don't... Okay, here we go. Here we go, let's get run open. Open run. And I'm gonna type in msdt.exe dash id device diagnostic. Okay, next. I like that we've also got the airplane making noises in the background to add to the circus music. <laughs> I don't see my device listed. It's not even showing up. Hold on. Will it detect? Let me try plugging something else then. Restart your PC to finish installing drivers and updates! My computer has given me the solution directly <laughs> to restart my PC. This is Okay! <laughs> God. Is there a way to update it without restarting? Oh! Ooh, there might be! There might be actually. Hold on, I remember. Dev management MSC. Uh. But it's not even recognizing that it's plugged in. Oh my God, this might actually be worse than I thought. Um. I just tried unplugging and then replugging in my external hard drive. The computer's not recognizing that either. Oh no. What did I do? <laughs> the external hard drive is running. I'm holding it in my hands. It is thrumming with energy. It is literally plugged in and working. And my computer's not recognizing it when I plug it in. What? What? I'm at a loss now, officially. Is my computer... Unknown USB device needs more power than the port can supply. Power surge on the USB port. I just got an alert. 
from Windows Explorer that says Power Surge on the USB port. What does that mean? Computer! Tell me more. A USB device has malfunctioned and exceeded the power limits of its hub port. You should disconnect the device. Recommendation, disconnect the device and click reset. If you click close, the port will not work until you unplug it and restart your PC. Oh my god? Okay, I guess I'll unplug it and hit reset then. Okay. It still says power surge on the USB port after I unplugged both the controller and and the external hard drive. And it won't stop popping up in the corner saying power surge on the USB port. What is happening in my life right now? I'm scared. <laughs> Why? What? Okay, well I hit reset. I did what it said. Can it recognize my controller now? Nope. Immediately it says power surge on the USB port. What? 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 Okay, I guess I'm looking up power surge on the USB port now. How do I fix this? How do I fix this? You're kidding me. I have to I have to open command prompt. Okay, I <laughs> All right. I guess we're opening the command prompt. Sure! Why not? Okay! <laughs> Why not? Doing that live on stream, I'm like actually kind of scared because the fact that it's saying there's a power surge is concerning me. Like, you're absolutely right. The plane has literally crashed before it's even taken off. I've actually broken, like, an aviation record. I, <laughs> I've actually managed to kind of achieve something here. Usually, usually, a plane has to be at least semi in the air before it can crash. Problems found! Your PC must be restarted! Jesus Christ! <laughs> well, I guess we answered the question in the stream title. Just not the way I expected to. Okay. I will be back, presumably. Um. <coughs> yeah, every time I plug it in, it says power surge on the USB port. What on actual earth? I guess we did accomplish something. Okay. Well, I'll be back, I guess. Lord, help me. Um, <laughs> I don't think I can blame this one on the FAA outage. 
hopefully your flight will resume. I mean, hey, hey, it's not it's not air travel with at least a couple of delays, am I right? <laughs> okay, well, I will be back soon, hopefully. Bye! Can you still hear me? Because it says it's restarting. I'm just curious. Oh, I think it... Oh, yep, okay, I think...